Today we're going to be speaking with Karen Weiss, who is the director of Waterworks Ministries, which is a brand new ministry out of the Susquehanna Conference. Thank you for coming, Karen. Thank you for having me. So how would you describe um, Waterworks Ministry? Waterworks Ministry is um, my primary appointment as a deacon, which is a spiritual formation, spiritual direction, and prayer support um, ministry. Okay. Um, and so is this something that um, parishioners would come directly to Waterworks Ministry, or is this more of um, a support for pastors? It's both and. Um, okay. Because I provide spiritual direction, um, which is typically a one-on-one -on -one relationship, anyone in the Susquehanna Conference um, can call me up and I can do that. Um, but with spiritual formation and, and the prayer support and, and outreach, there's it's much more of a, a congregational kind of focus. So it would um, be working with the pastor and whether it's the Ad Council or Mission and Outreach um, team to focus on a church-wide growth strategy. Perhaps the pastor um, would like to lead something about how to grow your faith um, and your prayer walk. Mm -hmm. And so um, perhaps he's one that has multiple churches in his charge mm -hmm. and he's not quite sure how to balance everything, mm -hmm. but he could call you up and, and you could help with that. Definitely. Okay. Um, I love strategizing. Um, I'm an engineer. Mm -hmm. by training so any way to plan or organize <laughs> um, gets me excited and so if there's a way that I can help pastors with with time especially because often like you said you have two or three churches that you're you know pastoring and there's not the time to put in to develop a cohesive um, discipleship or spiritual formation program and so that's something where I can come in alongside the pastor, alongside the leadership of the congregations, and work with them to assess their strengths and their needs and, and develop a cohesive plan. I saw one time there was um, this resource that could help congregations learn how to talk to people who were chronically ill. And mm. I thought that that was just um, interesting way so that they could learn how to talk to them that, you know, wasn't going to strike a chord if it was a sensitive issue, but they could feel mm -hmm. comfortable to talk to them so that the person didn't feel isolated. Um, what are some other types of um, resources, resource packages mm -hmm. like that that you think you might be able to help churches mm -hmm. with? There are some wonderful resources in terms of um, mentoring and discipleship models um, that are available. Um, there's one specifically that's a triad kind of mentoring where it's the mentor and then two people who are being okay. mentored. Um, and it's, it's a book actually that talks about how you go about doing that. That's um, a wonderful idea too with the intergenerational connections. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that's the thing that it can be, you can have a 35 year old mentoring a 70 year old or you know, a 12 year old mentoring an eight year old. It, it's quite spectacular the, the range of opportunities that you can use and, and ages and, and how you can get people involved at any age mm -hmm. in terms of discipleship and spiritual formation. Absolutely. Well, is there anything else you would like to share about Waterworks Ministries? Um, just that we are here for the Susquehanna Conference um, in any way that we can be a resource um, just to bounce ideas off of us or, um, you know, have a sounding board and provide those resources um, to the congregations and churches so that they can become more of who Christ wants them to be. Well, thank you for sharing. Thank you. Uh, if you would like to learn more about Waterworks Ministry or to get in touch with Karen, you can check out my Facebook page at Susquehanna Express. Express.